Hey, what's going on, YouTube? Hey, Aaron here, and we are back in the Suzuya, trying to do this video, and I think, honestly, however this video turns out, uh, I think I'm just going to go ahead and put it on the YouTube. Uh, it's a discussion-type video where uh, I just, I'm talking about this agile cruiser uh, play style that is so popular right now, uh, and I've been meaning to do this video for a while because, honestly, I see this almost once a game now where this person in a Suzuya or Mogami or... Even I, it was in a choppy of the other day, just immediately turns and puts themselves in this position uh, and does nothing for their team except farm damage. And while that is beneficial in some cases, y you are not providing the most support for your team playing like this. Uh, and again, this is my personal opinion, so if you get offended by that, I'm happy that you get offended by that. Uh, no, I'm just kidding. But, you know, let me know what you guys think down below. Uh, there's definitely situations where you need to kite and stuff, but running your Suzuya at 18.5 kilometers. You're, you're, you're doing nothing but really just padding your stats for damage, and damage is kind of a useless stat in my opinion. XP is a much better indicator of, you know, your qual the quality of your play, um, going for caps and things like that. Uh, let's make sure we don't get nuked at max distance here. Let's see what this guy does, and I, I hate picking on, you know, individual players, but uh, let's just see. Another Suzuya player. Looks like he's pushing in a lot more aggressively than I am. Let's try and take some shots at him. I mean, it's all—it's—it's it's almost a mirror image of what we're doing right now. He's—he's—he's he's, he's angled away. We need to watch out for that Georgia. Yeah, there he is. I mean, it—it's a—it's a mirror image. It—it's it, quite literally a mirror image. Uh, and like I said, in this situation, I can't, I can't, um, if that guy was on my team, I wouldn't have any problem with what he's doing right now, but as the game progresses, we're gonna, we're gonna try and, we're still gonna try and win the game, I always like to win, but we're also gonna try and just focus on getting the most amount of damage and, and target hits as possible without, like, being the <laughs> team player, if that makes sense. And I, I really hate that. I had a guy message me like, oh, well, I got 220k, I did my job. Like, well, yeah, but you were safe. We were about to lose, uh, and uh, hopefully I don't get absolutely obliterated here. Okay, one, ba one bounce? That showed I got hit. Uh, and he's like, oh, well, it's it's standard. I don't care about the win. And I, I just I disagree with that. So I have another video of the Suzuya. Uh, where I play a lot more aggressively. Now, that video is in a division. So I can understand the sentiment of solo play, you know, damage hunting. But at the same time, you got to play as a team. You got to be a team player. And everything that I preach is, is all about team play getting the win and, and supporting one another. Now, sometimes it's fun to go out and YOLO, but you still should try to play the correct way. So that Suzuya is equally as far back as me right now. I I mean, like I said, it's just, it is inevitable. Every game you, you will see now is, is just this because people are scared and they don't really know uh, if their team is gonna absolutely just lemming train into a, you know, oblivion. But our furthest cruiser forward uh, had no support and got blapped as a result. And with refill station active, uh, we can lob at this Bismarck at 18 and 18 and a half kilometers, which is close to the range of my Massachusetts. I, I do not have the lead on these down, mainly because it's so freaking far away. <laughs> Scared to die, but not scared to lose, exactly. I mean, here we have an Ochakov doing almost the exact same thing as us. Now, like I said, there's no destroyers, so he's, you know, his job as a radar cruiser is uh, kind of... You know, he doesn't have a job as a radar, radar cruiser right now. Need to watch this Georgia. Oh, I gotta go. This is not good at all. When did he fire last? We might be getting dev struck here, chat. This could be bad. Especially on the turn here. 
Oh, he fired at somebody else or didn't shoot. I mean, like, look at this game. It's just a bunch of backlining cruisers shooting at, like, medium to full range here. <laughs> uh, you couldn't have asked for a better game to highlight just kind of this problem that's existing in Legends. And again, sometimes you have to take what the game gives you, uh, but th there are better ways to go about it, in my opinion. Suzuki shooting at me from 17. That's yeah, just... And I'm on top, we're on top of each other, providing no firing angles, providing no additional support. Like, look at this. What does this game evolve to? Oh, these, oh my god, those were tight. I was lucky that wasn't a double citadel. Holy shit. I need to make sure he doesn't actually get a shot off, so we're going to cut back. Oh my god, dude, stop! Go, get away from me! Not a, yep, 40, not a single shot for me to, to try and reset it. This AP should actually probably kill him, but... I mean, this is just this is just not how you play the game. Just backlining, just shooting, just firing at medium to long range. No, no fire. You know, no crossfires. No. Uh, oh, did I touch you there? No cap control right now. Oh god. Oh, I knew that was going to hurt. <laughs> that tells me I need to be further away. I need to be as far back as this guy. I think he spawned on the other side, so. This is the perfect game, 40. This is the one. This is the one. No matter how this turns out, it's going on the tube, ladies and gents. Oh my god, how did he hit me so hard? I don't want to die! Kite, kite, kite. Kite, 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 kite. Kite, kite, kite. We kite. We get the most damage. We're going to do the best on our team. Guaranteed. Could you stop shooting me? That'd be nice. Thank you. Alright, good. We're undetected. We're, we're right in line with the furthest most ship in the back. Yeah, someone is further behind me, 40, right? I'm still getting shot at. Yikes, I'm famous. It'd be really nice if I could get a fire, though. I know I've been firing AP some salvos, but I have like 100 and some on target hits and two fires. I'm not running a Tago, though, which would be a nice... How to lose a game, guys. Do what I'm doing and uh, have a team like I had. Now, these guys are pushing up. Um, this Bismarck is. I don't know why he wasn't pushing up sooner, but he's still backing up. And again, this was, this was painful to play, and sometimes that's how the game goes. That's, the only thing you can do is farm damage. Sometimes that's just how it is. Uh, but most of the time, there's something you can do other than just being where I'm at, shooting my guns every eight seconds. Uh, I, I'd much prefer to have a radar cruiser with more utility, uh, and I just hate this style of play from these type of ships, but... Yeah, this is going to be a hard loss. 800 points to 55. Uh, but we've done our job as, in terms of farming damage in the back. <laughs> If only I could get one more fire to get some more damage. This guy's actually had some decent shots. Just dodge, though, bro. 
Just dodge. Can it shoot the guns, please? Thank you. And then there were... Oh, game's over. No DDs and players were still fate afraid to play their spawns. Yeah, 40, this, this game sometimes is... Uh, yeah, second on the board. That's a perfect... This game's going on the YouTube. Terrible game. Uh, 61,000 damage. I didn't do anything. Uh, but sit and try to farm damage. And a lot of people would look at this and be like, oh, well, my team is bad. And while while they didn't play, you know, as healthy, healthy as I would have, healthily, as uh, as well as I would have liked them to, uh, we didn't do our job either. We, we did not press stuff with our fast rudder. We did not get our torpedoes really on target other than at max distance. Uh, we were in the back the whole time. I don't think I moved further than into the cap, which I'm just, I, I'm cringing at. Um, and we got second on the board um, to a tier six who who probably, you know, played his butt off uh, and, and scored a little bit higher than us. Um, not to discount the enemy team. Uh, I, like I said, this Sharn Horse had a few good shots on me. Uh, and I believe I know that player. I feel like I've seen his name and he's, you know, played well a few times against me or with me. Um, so not to discount the enemy team, but this style of play, this backlining cruiser play is just, I hate it, um, and you're not benefiting your team. And again, these are my personal opinions. If you don't like that, uh, I'm sorry, uh, move on, <laughs> you know, uh, let me know what you guys think down below. Um, and again, I have a replay, uh, that for you guys of an aggressive Suzuya play, uh, high caliber, all the fun stuff that, uh, I will be putting up in a few days. Uh, so make sure to check that one out to see, you know, what I think the Sasuya should be uh, or, or can be instead of this backlining, just losing uh, ship. So I hope that was informative. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Let me know what you guys think down below. I, I feel like a lot of more experienced players or even a lot of players in general hate when players uh, do what I kind of just did here, uh, you know, right off the bat. You know, there's no the, the map hasn't developed. The game hasn't developed. And you're still just turn, you immediately turn and you're shooting at 18 and a half kilometers, which is battleship range. I don't think you should have, like I I I put this I put I meme build this with Kuznetsov and and beyond range, right now just just for this this specific video. So I would I would normally be playing with this and then like probably speed or fire chain I don't know, something else. Um, so that is the video. Bunch of talking points in there, but uh, hope you guys enjoyed that. A, A run out. Peace.